is the start of the Memorial Day holiday weekend, of course, and unofficial start to summer and usually pool season. Yeah, but there's a backlash tonight after the St. Louis County Executive announced what he is calling a target date for pools, gyms, and sports leagues to reopen. Fox 2's Andy Banker live tonight with new calls for a better game plan. Andy. Yeah, certainly no municipal pools this Memorial Day weekend, Jasmine, and that's not a surprise to anyone, really. Still, a lot of people have been looking forward to this with great anxiety. This is a long-awaited announcement, and here's what they got today. Municipal pools like the Aquaport here in Maryland Heights, plus gyms and sports leagues in St. Louis County, now have what the county executive calls a target reopening date of June 15th. But it is only a target. Nothing hard and fast about this. No details for reopening have been listed yet. County Executive Sam Page says the guidelines for pools, gyms, and sports will come next week. But youth sports have already resumed in neighboring counties. A Clayton gym owner says he shares the special concerns about his line of work, but he points to a study recently in South Korea linking a COVID-19 outbreak to large dance classes with prolonged heavy breathing in small rooms, but also showing no transmission in small yoga and Pilates classes at those very same gyms. He has submitted a plan to county officials to start small group classes under a canopy outdoors with only 200 feet, 250 people throughout the course of a day, down from more than 700 when he voluntarily closed now more than three months ago. He says after all of this time, people deserve better than the county's one size fits all approach. The gyms remain a high risk concern because of inability to wear masks due to limits on breathing and um, breathing when working out is high risk for transmission of aerosolized droplets and the spread of coronavirus. We should be able to go outside. We should be able to social distance outside and do workouts yoga studios and Pilates studios with lower intensity with social distancing, there is evidence that they should be able to operate. I do understand it's hard to segment, but to just stop everything um, is, is really unfathomable to me. Yeah, and it's hard to tell for him whether this target date is good or bad. Immediately after this announcement, he says he lost four more clients. Contrast that to summer camps. Dr. Page has set a hard and fast June 1st date for those to reopen with detailed guidelines already posted online. Live in Maryland Heights, Andy Banker, Fox 2 News. All right, thanks, Andy.